Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how to solve a problem that I've noticed or I've seen several times when people are trying to create a web page using web starts. A lot of times what they do is they add a text box like I'm about to do to their page somewhere near the bottom or wherever they just put it in here and what they do is they'll actually go in here highlight the text and then delete it now they'll click out and that text box will essentially become invisible they won't notice that it's there and it's still part of the page but it's just there's no content so therefore nobody knows that it's part of the page and then later on they'll go and they'll use the smart drag handle like right here with the footer or one of the smart drag handles for a strip like this one here and they'll run into a point where they cannot continue to drag the footer or that element up the page and that's because it's running into that invisible text box or that invisible element so what we've done to solve the problem and you may have already seen it is we've made it so that when you double click inside the text box and you delete all the contents and click out of the text box that that text box is no longer part of your page. It's no longer on your page. And that allows things like the smart drag handles to move freely without hitting any of these invisible text boxes. So hopefully you'll find that to be a helpful feature when working from within the Web Starts editor. Uh, it's just one of the continual changes that we make to try to improve the overall user experience. And um, if you haven't already done so, make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel to see more great videos with helpful tips on not just creating your own website, but also marketing it, getting traffic to your website, search engine optimization, and a lot more. And of course, if you haven't already done so, be sure to go on over to webstarts.com to create your very own free website. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.